So, so the first group today, we have Tess, we got Bailey, we got Faith Bird. What position did you guys have? Um, we said yes to GMO for plants, but no for animals and humans. Okay, so just plants. Mm -hmm. So, but without reading your whole thing, what's the big hang up you guys have with animals and plants? Well, with animals. No, animals and humans, I mean. For humans, I think if we already have like overpopulation and we just like eliminate why people are like already dying, then there's just gonna be like way more people. Okay. So like we don't need as many people on our earth. Even though like dying from disease is bad, but like I feel like our environment could be better without. Okay, people. cool. Are you guys ready to, to go? Mm -hmm. All right, whenever you're ready, talk loud so they can hear you on the, are you gonna do your video first? Uh-oh, Shaggy. Hang on for a sec. What'd you guys do? We just clicked the start button. Oh, it should be on. It is on. Oh, you muted it, Faith Bird. No, I didn't. No, yes, you did, right there, boom. Mute. I didn't like that. All right, let's see if it works now. Okay. Okay. Sorry if all of you watching at home on that. No. It'll make you sick for a second. Okay. Oh, did you just hit your head? <laughs> Do not let people genetically modify you. <laughs> okay, very nice. <laughs> All right, let's hear your thing that you guys wrote. All right. Talk loud. Genetic, okay, genetically modifying plants, animals, and humans can have a big impact on our planet and population. GMO is only good for plants and is dangerous for animals and humans. GMO for plants is a safe and effective way to keep pesticides away from plants. If we do not genetically modify plants and those bugs and insects get into our plants and crops, we cannot sell them, our farmers do not get money, and people do not get fed. Art artificial selection is another way to modify animals but not put them as high risk as GMO. Artificial selection has shown to be just as effective as GMO and is safer for the environment. If we eliminate people's deaths and edit their characteristics, less and less people will die. Our environment is already suffering because of overpopulation, deforestation, pollution, deforestation, and overpopulation. With eliminating deaths, those things are just going to get worse. Anything else, girls? Oh yeah, we closer. Oh yeah, let's see it. Okay, so tell us about it. Let's see. So, um, there's like the planet, and then this is just for being um, injected into um, a peach. And we think that plants being genetically modified is good. Do they do they do that with peaches? Did you guys choose a peach for a reason? No, or I just, you just looked picked up, a peach. <laughs> I just looked up GMO and plant. And that was peach was one. Okay. Talk loud. Okay. With animals, animals, animals. Talk loud, Faithbird. I'm sorry. Talk loud. With animals and humans, we don't think peaches. Inject them with CRISPR. Okay. Anything else, girls? Mm 